This video is made possible with help from Leland West, Pleasure Use Insurance for Porsches, endorsed by PCA since 1992. It's a time capsule. It took me back in time, back to the 80s. I bought the car in 84. It was really cool because it was the beginning of the Special Wishes program. And I really didn't know much about it, but I knew that you know if I had a chance to do something that was unique and custom, that I wanted to do it. And the first idea was pearl white, which was very kind of au courant in the 80s. I had seen a great soft gray leather interior on a Mercedes that I liked. He said he'd find me some special sports seats, special steering wheel, and all sorts of things. The turbo wheels, eights and nines, and it's been lowered. I designed that car with the guy in the little office, and I remember I was debating whether I should get the turbo look with the flares, and I remember uh, the German guy saying to me, ah, oh, but the coupe is faster. And I said, perfect, we'll have the coupe. My favorite part of the car is the memory that I have for my relationship with my wife, who was my girlfriend at the time. One of the first things we did was go on a date in this car. I think that's really what the car represents to me. I knew he was serious when he said, yeah, you can drive my car. Yeah. <laughs> and I sold it in 1990. It was our 25th anniversary in late November, and we were thinking, well, what do we get? Should I buy her a present? She was thinking, what, what do I get for, for John? I called John, and I said, let's give back something and just go with the feeling of gratitude. We had this little race car, and we decided to donate the race car to charity here at Amelia Island. 43, 42, 5, 5. Sold $45,000 each way, 45000 Thank you very much. Interestingly enough, when you give things away, sometimes that's you get things back. And that's when we found this. We call it the Karma Carrera because it just seemed like it had such good karma about it. At the same time we were deciding to give away the race car, we were trying to learn how to use Instagram. We were scrolling through and these cars began to pop up. This white 911 I appeared in a little box and I said, that looks like my car. And sure enough, it was advertised as John Oates, Special Wishes, 911 Carrera. At that moment, we both looked at each other and said, we got to get this car. And that's when we reached out to Ray Schaefer at Porsche Classic. So we had the car delivered straight from the auction site in New Jersey, right down to Hennessy Porsche. And that's the first time I saw the car in 35 years. When he called and told me that he had won the auction to get this car back, the car that he so lovingly built back in the 1980s, he said, you know, I really don't know what to do with the car. They had talked to Jeff's word about possibly doing a restoration or maybe a preservation. And with such low mileage on it, the decision was made that let's preserve it and make sure that it's as it left the factory. John didn't really know what baseline do I have to start with. I haven't seen the car since the early 90s is what he told me. And so I said, well, this is exactly what the classic technical certificate was developed for. So that someone can take their car into a Porsche Classic partner, they can have the technicians look at it and create a report, not only based on historical information, but also current information. John decided to stick with the process of how he had that car when it was originally new. Once the classic technical certificate process was finished, safety becomes the number one issue. What does the car need to keep it on the road as a safe driving vehicle? So needless to say, there's some suspension elements, braking, axles, and things that needed to be updated. Cosmetically, there's some items to turn back to factory in order to really make it that memory that he and his wife Amy had from the car back in its original days. John and Amy are wonderful people. The love that they have for what they remember together with that car and wanting to continue that now and make new memories with it. Drive and enjoy the car. I love the result. I mean, the car looks absolutely stunning. Period correct, classic 911 with a profile and the stance that it has. This is the 911 icon of the 80s.
Well, when I'm with my wife, I'm a cruiser. When I'm by myself, I tend to be a bit more aggressive. I think we're going to enjoy uh, cruising around the Tennessee uh, countryside in it. It drives great. The seats are incredible. Hey, what can I tell you? It's a Porsche. Without a doubt, the plan is to keep this car. This is a car that represents our history together. This is a car that we can hand down to our son. It's an heirloom, in a sense.